what if you make something with a negative metric? And I'm, pardon me whilst I do my origami here. So, many of you have seen me do this before. So I'm going to make the simplest compression of space possible. I'm going to take a little region of space like that, and I'm going to squash it. And as I squash it, the refractive index goes up. Of course, the metric increases. And I can squash it till, you know, the refractive index is infinite, infinitely positive. And then if I'm a mathematician, I can squash it a bit more. Like that. Now, that's a really weird space. This space you can understand, yes. But this is really weird, OK? Because if you've got something which is sitting here, the light sees it once, twice, and three, three times. So when you squash space like that, you've actually created, uh, inserted into space, three manifolds, if you like. The, the space is convoluted, and it has these three values here. And you do that by creating this region here, where you compress space up to infinity and then down to minus infinity. This is negative space, optical antimatter. It annihilates space which is next to it. 